All right, you're a seller and you just accepted an offer on your house and you're about to open escrow. What happens next? Even though we sat down before and talked about these things during our listing consultation and went through the steps of what's going to happen next, well, what? let me go through it again with you again, okay? But a little bit of, <laughs> I'll go through it with you again. But the first thing that's going to happen is the buyer needs to get their deposit into escrow. So we actually have an open escrow. So usually that timeline is going to be anywhere from 24 to 72 hours for them to get that into escrow. The next thing that's going to happen is going to be getting disclosures to the buyers. And with most of my listings, I have those disclosures all filled out prior to our first showing or our first open house. So as soon as that as soon as that uh, deposit comes in, we can send that paperwork over to the buyer so they can start looking at those because they usually have a shortened timeline during that contingency. Something people always ask, or I've had sellers agents or listing agents tell me this before. It's like, hey, if you ask for repairs or you do this, we're just going to cancel on you. Well, here's a secret for you. You can't, okay? As long as we have our contingencies in place, you cannot cancel on the buyer. They have contingencies in place to review disclosures, do inspections. You know, you need to have your house available for those type of things to get their appraisal done if they're getting a loan, to get their full loan approval done. So they have that timeline. It could be anywhere from 10 days, 5, 10 days, up to 17 days, 21 days to get all those things done. So if you're a seller, be patient. There's a process to that. I know a lot of people are like, well, they're playing games with us. They're wasting time. Maybe. But most of the time, they're not. They're just taking their time to make sure they know exactly what they want from this house and this, if this is the place for them. So those are the first few things that are going to happen from you. Um, the next one would be an escrow packet will come to you once escrow is open that you have to fill out for information. You'll be signing your deed, those type of things. But we'll go through that in another video. But just first steps, know what to understand that first week or two of escrow. Don't panic. It takes a lot to get that buyer to where they need to be. So you have to just be kind of open and nimble and understand that it's a process. Okay. If you have any questions about this process, let me know. I'd love to sit down and go through a listing presentation with you. Even if you're not thinking about listing your home right now, just kind of showing you what that process is. So you understand it when that time comes. I'd love to do that with you. Just let me know. Okay. Agent B here to help and you're ready. DM me and let me know. See ya.